Yeah, around 5.15 p.m., uh, Abbotsford police were called to a reported shots fired. Uh, the shots fired were emanating somewhere near the intersection of South Fraser Way and Emerson Street. Uh, upon arrival, Abbotsford Police Patrol Division officers located a South Asian male, mid-twenties, who was suffering from apparent gunshot wounds. That man was transported to hospital. Major crime unit detectives and forensic investigations uh, personnel arrived on scene and we began looking for a possible suspect vehicle. Based on witness reports, shots emanated from one vehicle into the victim's car, which was a dark colored sedan. No suspects have been taken into custody at this point. Regrettably, shortly after 6 p.m., the man succumbed to injuries in hospital. The file is now being transferred, transitioned over to IHIT, the Integrated Homicide Investigation Team. Further media updates will be available from IHIT. Certainly we are saddened by this incident. Uh, our condolences to the family and friends of this man. And obviously this is a concerning issue from the standpoint of public safety for the citizens of Abbotsford. Open air proceedings like this? Yeah, I, I guess uh, fortunately we haven't had a lot of exposure to this in recent years. That said, as we've maintained throughout, whenever there's conflict, whenever there's gangs, whenever there are people that are motivated by money and drugs, the potential for violent outbreaks like this always exists in every community. Do you believe this is a gang hit? Um, certainly at this point, uh, just at the early stages of the investigation, certainly some of the earmarks in terms of uh, happening in broad daylight, uh, gunfire between vehicles certainly are some of those things that we have seen in the lower mainland but I'll defer to the integrated homicide investigation team to, to provide some definitive answers. And once again it, was it just one vehicle shooting into the other or was it back and forth? Yeah at this point uh, witnesses indicated that uh, the victim's vehicle was shot at. Uh, I don't have further details than that at this point. Yeah the information based on the shots fired call was that uh, the actual uh, shooting took place on South Fraser Way or near the intersection of South Fraser Way and Emerson Street. And just to be clear, only one person was shot and only one person has been killed? Correct. We had uh, one individual who was injured as a result of the shooting. Unfortunately, that man, a uh, mid-20s South Asian man from Abbotsford, has succumbed to his injuries in hospital. Was there anybody else in that vehicle? Yeah, at this point in time, obviously a pretty confusing scene. We only had one injured party. He was transported to hospital. And as I mentioned, uh, unfortunate tragedy for his friends and family. And just to be clear, police were not involved in this in any way? Uh, police involvement was simply from an investigative standpoint. We were called to the shots fired, we attended, and obviously we are still diligently investigating as this file uh, begins to transition over to IHIT. Yeah, certainly uh, from a public safety standpoint, uh, that's why it's concerning obviously to the Abbotsford police and to the citizens of Abbotsford. Uh, South Fraser Way is, a, is our busiest corridor and obviously that's where most of our shopping complexes are located. Um, you're, you're absolutely right, 5 o'clock is a busy time of day regardless of the day of week, including Sunday. Uh, is the victim known to the police? Uh, I'm going to defer to IHIT to the background. Uh, at this point, obviously, identification and notification of next of kin still have to occur. Uh, I'm not sure at this point that a positive identification has been made apart from a South Asian male in his 20s.